Hi guys, I have to do a really, really quick video today because my battery on my camera is about to die. Um, I was going to do a video on my one size pocket diapers, but I do not think I have enough video left on this for that. So, right now you're just going to get a cute little glimpse of Jackson. Hi baby! Yeah! wearing his kawaii baby diaper and washing the rest of them today. Um, today I just kind of wanted to give you a... Oh, these shoes. I've got to tell you about these shoes. I bought them used. But, look. They're a Chuck Taylor Converse size 2, so they will fit him in probably another few weeks, actually. He's in size 1 right now, so... Yeah, and then I got um, just some no-name white shoes. I've got a one on the back. And I just figured, you know, they would be cute for... Uh, you know, any day outfit, they would match pretty much anything, and I bought these both used. The only problem I see with them is that these Chuck Taylors have a little bit of glue from the shoe right there, and I can't figure out how to get that off. But, regardless, these re retail brand new for like, I think like $27 at Target, and they're like brand spanking new because you know at this age a baby doesn't walk. So I got them for four bucks. And then these I got for three bucks. Again, pretty much brand spanking new because babies don't walk in them. Hi, baby. Yeah, right now I just kind of wanted to show you our setup for Jackson. Our bed is over here. It's a little bit messy right now. I apologize. Our bathroom is back there. We've got his pack and play up against the wall over here. Um... I wasn't crazy about using a pack and play, but then I found out that um, they make mattresses for these. Look, I bought a mattress, and it's like three inches thick. There's the bottom of the pack and play, well, the bassinet and the pack and play, and then there's the mattress that goes over. And then you can buy just pack and play ma um, sheets, and that's what I did. So this is just like super comfy, and it's we wouldn't have been able to fit an entire um, crib in here. So this pack and play is perfect. I did have a bassinet, a swinging cradle actually, and it's super cute. I love it. It was a, a Jenny Lind expensive one um, that we bought for really cheap at a garage sale and then um, um, like sandpapered it down and refinished it and it looks really, really nice. But Layla, my two-year-old, has a tendency to climb into things and I was afraid that she was going to break it, so we're not using that. Right here I have Jackson's... Woo! Well, there's the camera cord. Jackson's and Layla's cloth diapers. So I will talk a little bit about this. The top here, let me turn it back sideways. Sorry, don't get dizzy on me. I've got in this basket, I've got some um, newborn prefolds, which I use to stuff um, his diapers on the top if I need extra absorbency. I've got extra inserts. I've got just prefolds and inserts, really, in there. Different kinds of pre. And then some of his stuffed animals. Can't keep that up. And then I've got disposables, size 1 disposables for him in here. Um, we don't use them all that often. I just use them at nighttime and then like if grandma or grandpa or whatever are babysitting. And then this is Layla's disposables. That's all that's left of them and I am not buying any more. Um, we're trying to potty train her. Not going so well, but yeah. Third drawer down is all of the diapers that fit Jack now. I've got some Kawaii Baby. I've got a couple Sun Babies, my Cutie Babies, and O Katie. Some more Kawaii Sun Babies. Um, these are also Cozy, I think is how you pronounce it. And then Bum Genius, some more Sun Babies, and a Nicker Nappy. And I've got a, um, what's that one called? I forget. Oh, goodness. Grovia. Wow. Grovia diaper for him that fits. Fourth drawer down is the ones that Jackson can kind of fit into now um, for his one size, but I just haven't used them because I'm using the newborn ones first or the smaller ones. Got a few Alvas, Sun Babies. Um, this is a no name work at home mom. Sun Baby, Sun Baby, Alva, Alva. Um, a G diaper. These, I don't know what brand they are. I've never used them. I don't like them. Um, sun Baby, Sun Baby, Sun Baby, Sun Baby, and then a um, palm tree diaper cover, and then another Alba that he's got to grow into yet. The fifth drawer down is Layla's diapers, and a lot of her diapers are being washed right now, so um, that's why she's got so little. All Sun Babies, except this one is Alva, and this is a Bum Genius. This is one of my favorite diapers. I love the print on that. 
We use her Bomb Genius at night for her. Um, that's just what works best, and I triple stuff it. And then back here are her new pairs of Dora underwear that we are using as bribery. Last drawer down is some more pre-folds and diaper covers, and I've got some fitted diapers in here. So yeah, that's our diaper, cloth diaper get up right next to his crib over here. And then this is where I, uh, his little bathtub, I don't have anywhere to place, put it right now. Uh, right here, I keep, it's empty right now because I'm washing, all of his, uh, Layla and Jackson's dirty cloth diapers. And then this one is, I'm not going to pop it open because it's pretty gross, but it's all like the poopy wipes and the wet wipes and all that stuff. Because I don't use disposable wipes. Um, or I use disposable wipes. I don't use reusable wipes. Because Jack has, whew, look at the mess over there, sorting out and packing away clothes. So that's why it's such a mess. Bear with me. Um, anyways, I don't use anything but Huggies like natural care wipes on my kids because Jack has a huge hemangioma on his tush just a couple like a half an inch from his butthole actually and it bleeds occasionally so we can only use the really soft disposable wipes right now uh, the doctor said he should grow out of it but it's looking right now that they're gonna want to remove it surgically which I'm not too thrilled about he's not old enough to have that kind of surgery but if it keeps bleeding and, oh man, we're spitting up, um, keeps bleeding and is irritated, then uh, we're going to have to have it removed. Otherwise, he said by the time he's in, you know, ready for kindergarten, it should go away, so. All right. Yeah, you're such a happy baby today, aren't you? Yeah, diaper change and full belly. Yeah. All right, guys, that's all I've got for today, so I will see you tomorrow. Bye.